It's the largest one-day loss in history, and for the first time in two decades, trading was halted trying to break the sell-off. The circuit breakers slowed but didn't halt the dramatic decline. Wall Street hit from almost every direction today. The national left-wing media playing up fears of the coronavirus that has now infected at least 113,000 people, as I said, in 111 countries and territories around the world. We'll turn to the dimensions of the pandemic here at home later in the show. Selling this morning started on global markets when Vladimir Putin refused to go along with Saudi Arabia and OPEC plans to cut prices and push up production. The Saudis slashing prices after Russia refused to boost their oil production. The result, oil prices suffering the worst collapse since 1991.